There we go. I have now captured her in the square. She moves. Hello, everyone. This is Tuesday. We're going to be tweaking some things, learning some things about, I think, some ATCs and this, that, and the other. Uh, Just little tips and tricks. Tips and tricks. This is P over here. M over there. Patricia. Mariah. And together we, we are PM Artist Studio. And my glasses are downstairs. I'm going to go get them for her in just a second. Okay. Do say hello in the chat so we can say hello back. Otherwise, we do not know that you're here. We'd love to know that you were here. Oh, we my gosh. Friendly. She's just, she just ruins my little spiels. <laughs> hello, everyone. I'm going <clears> to... <throat> I'm just going to say hello to everybody here in the participants uh, list. Just go ahead. I'm, I'm trying to find us. <laughs> Make sure you turn your chat over to live chat so that way you don't miss anything. That's another great way to, you know, make sure you're you're, you're all in here. Okay, what am I doing? Yeah, participants. Dear Lord. Okay. Angela Dent is here. Angela Rydell. Hello. Art Curious. That's Miriam, Becky, Bo Kern. Carrie Griffiths is here. Charmaine Cheshire. That's Dar. Darcy, Deb C. Eddie, Ellen, Erna, Kathy, Katura, or Ketra. She's a woman Ketura. with two. Yeah, she says Ketura. That's what I said. She's, it was. She said that was okay. Erna, let's see. Did I say Erna? I said Erna. Somebody else popped in there. <coughs> right above there. I don't know. Maybe Ellen. God, I need my glasses. My okay. bags are just terrible. <laughs> Your glasses hide them? Yes. Okay. Linda, Lisa, Lisa, Lydia, Mary, Ellen, Nancy, Nancy, Naomi, Patricia, Paula, Pinka, Ricky, Normeyer, S-S-O-S, S-A-G, that's Sarah, Sarah, Star Traveler, that's Linda, Susie, Allen, oh my gosh, there's a bunch of people that just popped in. The Shelley Studio, that's Margot, Tina Schvonberg, Trish Coogan, Wendy, and a bunch of other people that popped in there, and okay, like Barbara, Bruja, oh. Candy. From San Miguel de Allende. That's where Dawn lives. Y'all with the, the names earlier in the, in the alphabet need to show up earlier and say hi. So that way it's up on the top of the list. You know, coordinate. That's all I'm asking. You, I'm are, so, you, you are so right, Deb C. What does Deb C say? She said that glasses hide a myriad of faults. <laughs> Just for seeing. That, that might, yes, they, they do. And... Uh, <laughs> I, I will go get yours here in just a second. Um, do you want me to just put you on so there's not a, like a blank screen here? Uh, yeah, that would be good. I'll just put the P cam on. Cause I'm I'm thinking about my my cardboard. Y'all get the full view. You, you're gonna with get brushes and everything. See, that's why sometimes the the. Oh yeah. Anyway, these are the struggles I have, y'all. One moment. Yeah, it it right just back. it is real the struggle. <laughs> it's real. All of them. <laughs> anyway, packaging. We're going to talk about you know y y utilizing what you have in packaging, but not all packaging is the same, and some of it warps more than other. So what I did was I cut in pieces off and we're going to gesso them today to sort of determine you know what's their warpage because some of them do really warp weird warp out of shape I'm hoping that this is this is not as tall as I want it to be this particular stone fire non crisps there by the way very good um, but I like it. It's really sturdy. So I'm, I'm just trying to think how I'm going to use use that in my... Um, Were those good? Oh, they're really good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They're not as nonny as I thought they would be. Not as nonny. But um, they are crisp. <laughs> they are. Yeah, I don't know that I would necessarily call them. Well, they're... Oh, there. Hello world. Yeah, I even cleaned them up as I was coming up the stairs. Oh, that's good. Bit. Well, I gave him a bit of a wipe also. Uh, do I need to go topside? <clears throat> uh, sure. Because it looks like you got some things that you're talking I about there. I do. And I'm going to kind of move this out of the way here in a minute, but I just wanted to go through, you know, mm -hmm. it's hard for me to talk about something when I'm doing it. And you all have noticed that. Yes. And this is one of the reasons I think that I, I do better at voiceovers. 
because I'm watching myself and I'm going, oh, look what I'm doing there. Let me see. And I understand better and I'm able to make it come out of my mouth rather than just staying inside my head and thinking everybody already heard that, mm -hmm. you know, because you're telepathic or whatever. Mm -hmm. But, yeah. Yeah. I've really been having, you know, sort of a epiphanal moment. I know. Please probably. somebody Google that. Adverb oh. Adverbial form of epiphany. <laughs> uh, anyhow. Epiphanical. It's a really good bread, too. <laughs> Oh, that's Sometimes so funny. I can get her. That's yeah, just so <laughs> funny. I, I, just, <laughs> I just remember um, her father was the choir instructor for a while, and then I was in charge of Bible school for one summer at the United Methodist Church. And, of course, my children had to attend because, um, yeah, their parents were there. But we, we, it was right around Easter, so we did the whole Easter thing, and we created our own... Um, what do you call those, you know, that where you go up and put them in your mouth things? Um, communion. There communion crackers. It's been a while, y'all. <laughs> but it was just hysterical because we, ha we had the... Um, you made them? You, I, the pre-K pre class made them. Mm -hmm. yeah. Now, some of them we just threw them out because they were like, oh my God, they had all kinds of things embedded in them and who knew, <laughs> you know... <laughs> Even Jesus wouldn't put that in his mouth. Uh, yeah. He's like, so, thank you. But, yeah. Oop, but, nah. <laughs> but, you know, it was one th It was to get them all involved, and we did the whole Palm Sunday thing with the palms and the things. The kids absolutely loved it. It was a lot of work. And anyhow, so that's the pivot. <laughs> Anything with pre-K is lots of work. It certainly is. <clears throat> anyway, so I thought... You know, it would be a good thing, as you've been seeing me do this, and if I actually wrote it down here, and Mariah could possibly even, you know, take a... Screen. I'll make a post in Makers. Yes. I also added a new, that's why I was a little bit behind, because I was kind of doing that. I added a new hashtag called hashtag events. So any of y'all that are already in Makers, if you use that hashtag in the... In the chat, it will then give you the link directly into what is called announcements, because that's what they used to call it over there on Facebook. But it is the events, the features. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If y'all want to know more about those. Yeah, all, all about wordage. Mm -hmm. Wordage and verbiage. Okay, so I went ahead, and the, these are the, can you see these? Yeah. These are the ones that we made last session. Or, no, Sunday. Because this is Tuesday. And Mariah we, we are so messed up. Okay, was here yesterday. And here's the thing. Because, you know, Izzy was home for MLK. And then it, 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 it froze. And people in Texas, I don't, I, seriously, this is the most mind-blowing thing. Because we have had worse weather. And I've been like, why are we going to, you know, why are they sending kids to school? Yeah, when it's an ice rink out there. And all, like, roads are clear. It's cold. It's very cold. But, but there's absolutely it. no moisture on the ground. The little bit of snow that did hit was, was all very puffy. fluffy and has gone away. <laughs> With like the bluebirds. <laughs> but no school today. Okay. So, yeah. yeah. I, I, I hope a whole lot of parents called and really yeah, or like, bitched what, and moaned about that. Are you kidding me? Because it's just, you're going to have to make it up. No. They, no? No, they said don't worry because they'd already, maybe that's the whole deal. They're like, well, you know, we already worked it into the... Well, I could have worse weather later on. I don't know that I'm I necessarily... Know. February. Yeah, that, that's sometimes our worst. Mm -hmm. Anyhow, so <clears throat> I went ahead... And hello to everybody that's coming in. And I used this little little device that I, I, I made out of the Kurataki box. It, it's my little window thing. And you can see I had an X on it, but I didn't like that because it would really messed me up. So I went down with the nail polish remover and took the X out of the middle and went around the edge with um, a permanent marker mm -hmm. blue so that you can see this is where you know this is where your you can scope out your design when you've got a whole big piece it's a to scoper see. it's a scoper some people call it a viewfinder viewfinder 
And we used to do this when we did watercolor. We had oh, we've the, done it a mat. few times. Um, remember when we did the white? Um, I can't remember when we did this before, yes. but it was a long time no, ago. No, I'll show you. I'll show you because people love seeing the books. We did a we, we made a big hoodoo out of it. A big hoodoo. But the really nice thing about this is, and you can see here those little dots there. When I looked at this here. again, remember that. Oh, yeah. Because these were some prints that had some really great areas and then some not so great areas. There's a video. I think there's like a whole stream or maybe two streams. I spent a lot of time. Yes. She kind of wore me out with the, the trying to find the perfect prints. The perfect print. And these are early on, so you can see how much we've... But I do, I still love some of this stuff. And I made sure that I got the good... Mm -hmm. Oh, and we talked about, you know, which side was the best and we were gonna what we were going to cut off. But yeah, this is and this these are our our printables. Are they? This one is. That you printed on. I printed over the printable. Yes. Yes. But look at that. Isn't that mm -hmm. nice? Those little tur oh, that is. turquoise turkey tracks out there. This is a printable. Printed over. Yes. And look at the nice patina on that. And then this over here. Let's oh, <laughs> Deb would like to know, what is the advantage of doing this with an acetate as opposed to an open frame board? Ah, that is a very good question. Because with the acetate, you can see more of what you've got around you. The other, the mat board, you're, you're blocking out a lot of stuff. So this lets you really scope out, you know, what you've got going on there. Mm -hmm. All around it. And I would also say that it probably holds up a little better. Now, on the con side of it, it's clear for the most part, so yeah, it's a little it's, easy, harder to find. Yes, for those of us who are challenged in that <laughs> area. You know. <laughs> okay, and so then what I do, and I put little dots, and you can see, I, I just want to line up. I want it outside of the frame, because where that blue is, that's where my ATC is going to be. And again, I'm using my gel plate as a... And hello, Tutu. It's keeping everything kind of... And I think hello to Kathy that came in. Hello to Devin. But anyway, I think it's worth Monica. taking the time to do this. Because it doesn't matter. And here's what I discovered when I was doing this. I knew I was going to have to cut off either the mm -hmm. hair or the chin. I decided the hair... Hair. Hair. Yeah. I mean, you and, get that it has hair. Yeah. All right. And here on the sheep, it's the same thing. They really need to be a teeny, 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 teeny bit. I made them as small. Are you sure that your thing is the right size? I'm absolutely, but it goes right to the edge. So a little bit of that, yeah. you can see. You know? Lose a little of the poof. Lose, it's just, no, it's right right on there. Yeah. Right, you maybe only lose one little loop of the poof. I mean, because really, I was, I was pushing it. Yeah. And I don't, I don't know what you could absolutely do differently. But anyway, when it's that close, it's really important, uh, you know, to get it on there. Then I went back in I and I colored them in with um, the transparent uh, color sh sh shift. Either lose a hoof or a puff. Lose, yeah. See, and over here, I could have gone up a little tiny bit more there. I do you see how close it is? I'm justifying. It's fine. I, I think it's okay. <laughs> but now I've got to share with you the backs of these because um, I'm not going to make any more ATCs today. I'm just going to talk through this and let you um, enjoy it. Okay, check it out. Hey, she did those backs. Oh, wow. I didn't even notice that you'd cut around that one. Oh, I need to. She only did one of those. That's yeah. No, <laughs> I did two. Oh, you did. And I got tired. Yeah. Okay, here's my other one, but look at that. It went a little dark there, but that's all right. You can still see it. Yeah. But do you see the, the shimmer? And what I did is I used the mm -hmm. Thalo Blue, the Blick Artist Fluid Acrylic, along with the Dragonfly Glaze. And I don't know if it's this one. I think it was the other one because I'm almost out of this one, but it doesn't matter. Because, you know... The, then the, you order a new... Th you have more. I have more. Okay. I just haven't dug them out because I want to use every last little bit. But it really was great <laughs> because it well. knocked it back enough 
that you could still see the design of the um, card. And then on this one, this was cool because... Deb says, did you mix the paint or layer them? I mixed it in together. Nice. I mixed them together on the plate. Yeah. And then you can see I did the edges. Look at that. Hello, hello, hello me. Am I in the right spot? Yeah. See the sparkly edges? See, I taught her that. She, she used did. to not. I, I have some lifting here, which I'll have to take care of, but that's okay. Yeah. I think that happened when I went back and sponged on my... Well, and if they are still kind of drying... Oh, uh, they will? They, yeah. Okay, well, I guess I just need to do that. But check this out. So this happened because I did this this side. Remember, this is white. And it's texture. Yeah, that's texture paste. So it's, texture paste. It's like a little, you know, texture plate. Hear that? And then I flipped it over and put this on the back before I put the little our little um, info things. Yes. Okay. Well, you stick around today. You might be the proud possessor. Yeah. Of one of these. Stay things. to the end. Or make sure you get back here by the end. <laughs> Well, we might, you, you don't want to leave because we might just throw one in here and, yeah, in you know, in, any time now. See, she didn't think about that. It, it's um, Pavlov's theory of once you yeah. have your uh, animals conditioned, it, it's, um, what do you call it, Inter intermittent, non-predicted is a better form of reward. All right. That, oh, and here, I want to show you this one because this is also, remember? This was, this was from this the, that card. This was the pull-off on, on that card. So, creating ATCs from Brayer Offs. This is page one of two. Number one, have a variety available. You never know what color you're really going to need. So, just have some that you can grab and slap down here real quick like. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Different sorts of color, color overlaps. All right, number two, if using the modeling paste with a stencil. Be ready to wash it off after three or four passes, especially if it's like the sheep. I would say even maybe two passes on yeah. the sheep because they're very, um, <clears throat> yeah. Hey, and Tutu Hale, she is doing ATCs over. She's she's kind of mixing them up. She's got the freshen it up. She's got, I think, did, she did the color combo on one, like, Tutu, you are handling business. And I very much appreciate it. We see you. We see that you are using hashtags and mixing up all the different events. And so she's doing her ATCs for the swap, plus then, you know, freshening it up. That's the Makers Creative Collab. And then, well, really, you know what's funny? And sorry, I just, I really did mean to, to kind of call this out because it, it really is great. And, and it sort of evolved in a way where I was like, yeah, that actually makes more sense. All of this is the Makers Creative Collab. Yes. All of the events. So yeah. you can put in whatever you want with it. And then, you know, I mean, obviously we have, like, as a theme, Maker's Creative Club is, like, the freshen it up. But really just tie that into everything else. And, like, you've got a wham, bam, awesome content. So well done. Well done, y'all. Okay. There you go. And and uh, th this is my way of, you know, Mm -hmm. codifying what I do because I don't do it when I do it I know that all right oh no um th this is my design so the backs of our ATCs is just something I put together because I didn't really want like ours are not like it doesn't tell you card blah 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 whatever because a majority of them are pretty much you know one of one <laughs> There's oh. not going to be a card, even if they're sort of in a series, which I, I know some people do that too. So, but each and every one of them is unique. And then we, I put like, I have our signature and all that scanned in, but then P has been writing in the actual date. I used to have the year on there automatically, but no. Yeah, we took it off. Cause I wanted it to be very PMR studio versus like kind of what you see in other it's a little more arty, a little more, you know. Yeah. She, she. And then I read Tutu's <laughs> comment about that. In, in Hawaiian, that means to go pee, I think. Yeah. Or that you need to go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, stencil butter. Depending on the, on the stencil, delicate parts, not so much, use a palette knife to apply. 
and clear off the extra butter. Mm -hmm. So remember when you do that palette knife, if and the reason it's a good idea is because of the bend of it. And you want to use the heel, I always say the heel, mm -hmm. the back side, and pull across lightly. Yeah. That's the trick. And then, depending on, you know, the stencil, using a circular motion, wipe off remaining butter and with a baby wipe onto the brayer off. And you see me do that all the time. And I just rub it off all over the place. Uh, check your small openings, crevices that tend to hold onto paint. Scrub with a soft brush on a flat surface under this, with a flat surface under the stencil to support it. And it will facilitate the paint removal. I use a, a small nail brush nail brush which is not really it's not stiff it's, it's really really soft yes. okay Hello, Kathleen. now using your papers to create well, uh, whatever you know the papers that we made with the brayer off and whatever and the plastic piece as a viewfinder one of the other things you need to consider when you're moving that viewfinder around is how to balance your ATC and how to make sure you've got repetition with enough variety to keep it interesting. Okay, that's why you have that little, all that little window there. And this is a good example because here I've got the actual shape of the ATC, which is almost, it's spot on perfect. The circles, mm -hmm. it's right there. But if I move it down here, see I've got these other interesting lines. This is actually a more interesting composition. Now, is that showing up or is it shining? Yeah, you're good. Because it has that bit in there, so I've got a little of the top and a little of the bottom here, and I think that's a more interesting mm -hmm. ATC. Plus, I could do some other things on top of that. And that's the thing. Once you, you start doing that and you get it off and you look at it and you say, well, you know, I like it, but mm -hmm. I really think it might be slightly better if I would do, you know, whatever. Okay. Any questions? Hello, Sophia. Ch changing gears here. Oh, and see, we've got that one. That's a really good one. I'll have yeah. to. I'll put that off over here. And, yeah. Now, um, that that and the circles that she just showed are from that latest ATC set of stencils available. I think it's an exclusive. Yes, because it's one of ours. Um, and then the mask one was Paula's from the Mardi Gras set. And those are in the shop as well. I'm hoping that maybe Thursday, for sure-ish, Sunday. But Sunday's going to be a big day. It's the giveaway day. Yeah, it is going to be a big day. Well, I think probably I'm just going to go ahead and stick with my... I, I really wished I'd, I'd put a little more of this really oh, beautiful yeah. turquoise into... But you've got some there. So I, I think I probably would just stick with the outlines of the original. Well, the other thing that you could do with that is if you <clears throat> wanted, um, you could kind of cut it. You slide it over so that way you have that kind of cool background. And then what would be kind of neat is if you cut then whatever you have left over cut the pieces and then maybe even just stack it well that's what mariah would do that's I, what I, mariah would do i i i can just categorically tell you here's right the now, funny thing that ain't happening pete will layer the bejesus out of something if the gel plate is in 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 play now we're talking about cutting out things and gluing them down yeah not so you much. might get one or two things yeah <laughs> and that's it. That my attention span has been it's raised like... and and bypassed. Okay. Now let's yeah. get get our stuff up here because I just wanted I wanted to show you and I I know this probably that this is like too much more information you really cared for. I don't know if you have one of these or if you have some other type of letter opener, but those work really good to get in there without tearing the holy. Yeah, we're moly not, out yeah, we of your see that box just just saying that now you can tell right away this is slightly corrugated 
So what we're going to do is we're going to cut off a little piece here and we're going to test it out and see if it warps. I don't know if it will or not, but I think it's 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 worth a it's worth trying because okay. it's really great cardboard and I know it's going to work for some of the pages, some of the shorter fatter I, I need bracelets. <clears throat> what? Some W uh, uh WWMD. Oh, did you show them that really beautiful one you have on right there? It doesn't say WWMD. These are my bracelets. I, I don't know why you keep thinking that. I, I think that they were our shared bracelet. Maybe one of them was yours for sure, but one of those was definitely mine because it's that same. The caps that, are for sure mine. The, um, those earrings that you wore the other day. Yeah. I didn't put earrings on today. I wasn't sure if I was going to wear a hat or not. Okay, so we've got this, and you can tell which one it is just from the back side of it, so that's your reference point. The tissue paper stuff, you really have to be careful with, because I remember when we were doing it on that, that journal, it, we had to put it under under glass to get it back flat before we... About? The little um, one that we cut in two and squeezed it together. Oh, yes. Yeah, because it's, it's, it's flimsy. Mm-hmm. It's very flimsy. We did. So I don't even have to show you that because I already know that. It had to be restrained. It had to re be, yes. Okay. So then I've got Morning Summit here. And you can see that's a little, it's a lot like this one. You can see the, the um, pattern of the corrugation there. Yes. Morning tip. Treat both sides of the surface after you pull back the the back side. It yes. may pull up and yes, yeah. and whatever. And whatever. I've got some fuzzy stuff here, mm -hmm. but I, I'm not going to worry about that because these are all going to be covered up with something anyway. The reason I'm doing the gesso right now is because that saves you from a lot of problems later on. And it gives you a nice white surface to work with, so whatever you put down on top of it, yeah, no then worries. that's what you're going to see. Okay, so this is the cheese it Oh, look, I can just use that. There's this, this cheese it box. Darn cheese it Jesus. And I'm keeping these little pieces because a lot of times I like to make little yeah, um, we don't have any of those. pulley uppy downy things. What? what? Little cardboardy pieces. I mean, should I bring out the scraps again? <laughs> you should just shush it. But yes, in this group of things, you do not have any of those. Therefore, it is a very wise thing to have at hand. Yes. And I've got these other pieces cut up over here. I don't know whether we're going to get to that part today or not. And I don't know how um, how interesting this is going to be. So if you get really warning. get really bummed out on this, you just, can just say. You know, strike up a conversation in the chat. Say, okay, I think I got it. Can we move on? Yeah. In which case, I'm going to jump print some stuff today. But I want to talk about the book. And we may go ahead and cut out a couple of pages from the book. Because remember I have my mock-up? Yes. Okay. All right. Here we go. Let's find a Whee! crap brush here. <laughs> this isn't the crappiest one I've got, but it's really close. It's, <laughs> yeah. okay. it's its friend. <laughs> it's its friend. And um, it's just like somebody said, you want to do both sides of your... You know, it's funny. It's like mine isn't showing... What? I'm not seeing like real time um, stats today, which is very interesting. Well, sometimes I don't see real time chat until I, you know. What if I refresh this? If all will be okay. okay. So basically, when do you want to do this? You want to do this after you have the shape that you want. Mm hmm. Okay. All right. Now we're going to set that over there to dry. It's already going wonky on me. Yeah. I'm hoping this stuff is going to, I've never used this, this particular um, yeah. type of corrugation here. I just, I don't know how well it's going to cut the, go. the fine lines that I want to cut. But you can still see that, but by the time I get something on hey, top of it, it's not going to be an issue. <laughs> <laughs> yes. What? <laughs> Safia, it's this crap brush. The trademark here for the technical terminology. <laughs> yeah. Find yourself a good crap brush. <laughs> you don't care if you mess it up. And yeah, the ones that you would, you know, that your children have used or... 
Uh, uh, used and abused. Used and abused. Okay, this is our non-cracker box. Again, it's corrugation. It just seems to be going the other way of the uh, Summit mm -hmm. cereal. Oh, and I did get out a Kashi box, just a regular one that you buy at the store. And they were hor that's horrible. I'm not even, I know it won't even work. Uh, does your color of gesso make a difference? Well, yeah. Yeah, one book that I did, I did black. Yeah. And that's when I decided I didn't want to do that anymore. That that stuff's like tar. Let me, well, and here's the other <laughs> kind of problem about black gesso or even matte black paint is it scuffs. And it's very, very difficult to get it in one nice, even, consistent coat. Oh, I, I worked. Remember that one book? I worked. And I bet it has five coats yeah. of that stuff on it. The black I did is it very hard ever. to work with. Ever and ever. Okay, we've got that one done. We've got that one done. I can go ahead and just go ahead. Because I know that I'm definitely going to use this part of my... My, um... <laughs> yes, exactly, Sophia. That, that's box. the brush. <laughs> And I may, you know, I may change the circle, the oval to another yes. shape, but I, I don't know that yet. All right, Deb, bringing in the, the info. The reason it goes wonky is the paper expands when wet. It looks more wonky next to places which are not affected, which is why you want to, to wait do. for it all to dry to see if it shrinks equally. Deb knows these things. Yes, the scuffs are, the, the scuffing is real. So, you know, that's something to keep in mind. Like, if you are utilizing the black gesso as a, you know, like, okay, I'm going to cover this and this is going to be the color that it is. And, and I didn't. I went over the mine. Eyes. I went over mine with, um, matte. Matte medium. Yes. I think it was the matte. Mod Podge. Yes. To be exact. No, I don't know how. <laughs> Brad this, is this. putting on the hardcore press. Those of you that are here and have joined us, do give those thumbsy uppies if you haven't already. It's very important. It is like, okay, the number one way you support us. Subscribe to the channel. It's free. No problemos. And what it does is it lets other people know, hey, I like this channel. You're going to like this channel. Like other people that are liking the same things. And then when you like the video, that's like, ooh, double. You yeah. really like this. I and like I don't know channel. if I told you or not, I but like I also, I love the comments. I And she loves the comments. We love the comments. We talk about the comments. We do. <laughs> and some of them are just, just crazy wonderful. Yes. So, you know, be funny in the comments if you want to be. Be informative. I, I love that. The, the thing about, and I even looked up some glues, you know. Oh, I know. The glue discussion seems to be oh, really and I taken this, off. This, well, I know, and I watched this one lady. And, you know, obviously, you know, and I, I'm not saying this in a ugly sense. I'm just saying it in a factual sense. She was not at all interested in the longevity of her artwork. So she wasn't considering the acid free. Yeah. And Fran says that too. Like Fran's very much that way. She's like, this is about me and this is what I want to do. I don't care if it lasts till whenever. Hey, I, you know, I don't either. But here's the thing that I do care about. I do care about it yellowing and changing color. That irks me. In her when lifetime. When that happens. In her lifetime. In my, in, yeah. <laughs> and sometimes it does. I, I mean, I've sat there and yes. watched it. Sometimes it's just a week later and you're like, what the? Yeah. And, and it, what it does is it takes away from... Oh, no, I loved your... I told you that even though that was my comment back. I said, you just rant away, Deb. I love your rants. Yeah. <laughs> Usually you know, her rants are very it, much like, like she's passionate about Changing the channel. I don't have to read it. <laughs> Deb's I, I don't understand today. people, you know. They're, they're manifestos of yeah, her, her, yeah. her arty um, technique knowledge and of products and techniques. Yeah, I, I got that out of the way. Did mm -hmm. you see that, Mariah? You didn't even have to tell me. Look at that. Aren't you proud of me? Very proud of you. Every day I'm proud of you. Mm. No, you're not. You're saying that. Okay, now, you know, we have the missing book. Oh, you found it. Okay, so we already discussed that, you know, really, I'm not going to gesso these for real. 
until I get the shapes cut out that I, I want these to be. All right? Everybody understands that. So I've got cheese it mm -hmm. cheese it fat and cheese it thin. Hello, Raven. And I did cut the ends off of them because I already knew what I was going to do with my pages. If I was mm -hmm. indecisive about what to do with my pages, I would have left this little Hello, do. Anna Maria. Uh, no, we do not make our own gesso. Dear Lord. Show them the big, Li show them the big thing Life's too gesso. short for that kind of stuff. This is the best way to go. 32 ounces. <laughs> Cheap Joe. It's ever bit as good as any of that expensive stuff. You do not... Yeah. Gesso is not one thing that I want to spend a lot of money on. Oh, that's hilarious. So, Atkins says you, you guys are influencers. I bought Marie Callender's Pot Pie Frozen just for the box. <laughs> Remember, don't sand it. Don't sand it. Just what right away. But they are fantastic boxes. They are. Well, plus her pot pies are really good, too. Yeah, they really are. I mean, you know, come on. She's the standard I'm not eating those the anymore, pot pies. Unless you go to that, what was that restaurant? And then they took it off the menu. They took it off. Oh, yeah. I pitched a fit. And the Grand Lux at the Galleria. I, I said, you know, I, I really just, I, I'm so disappointed. I almost feel like I should just leave and not order anything. Yeah. Now, that gesso will not be on our Amazon list, but thank you, Mo, for putting that in there. Um, I do have the Montmartre te Texture Gesso because we get that over there on Amazon. I also yeah. included the glue, so that's all over there in the store, and I even called it, um, I think, Mediums and Adhesives. Things get sticky. <laughs> oh, with Max. Like all right, now, because I watched Fran do this, I left this one on because, look, Oh, if you bend this back this way, look at this. Okay. You've got a ready-made super, super duper pocket here. So I, I, mm -hmm. I can always cut it off. Okay. So Deb was not here the day, and I'm sure we have some other people. So something to keep in mind about frozen food packaging. Um, I had a, I had a, a subscriber reach out. And she's like, in hearing the commentary about the frozen food packaging, I wanted to share a little piece of info that you might want to know. The various paper products used in packaged frozen food and much of takeout food has a coating that prevents the grease from coming through the package. That product is a carcinogen and you really do not want to be disturbing it. It's similar to the finish that's on Teflon pans and you should never use those after they scratch or if it. If you have birds in your home, the fumes, if it gets overheated, will kill birds. Think canary and coal mine. In fact, the use label tells you to discard the pan if it is scratched or overheated. I used to teach a class before I retired about material chemistry and environmental health concerns that are not common knowledge for most of us. These are a few that we live with every day, mainly because there isn't a safer alternative that performs well enough to be used. I always thought it was just a heavy duty wax, but learned that it is not the same. So. So, and we thank you very yes. much for that information. That is not something, like I said, it's not something that's common knowledge. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, well, you all watched Mariah do the magical, the Mag magical magnets. And oh, here, I want to show you this. This is cool. Okay. So, if you're indecisive about it, you know, and I, I essentially, I want, I want you to look at the, wonderful colored pencil. Uh, she, she did a little more work. I did a little bit more work around the edges here to enhance that already. I think it looks like, like, like you know, the lichen that grows on, you know. Oh, yeah. Has, it just looks like that. It almost feels, or it looks like it's going to feel like that. Yeah. Yeah, and see, there's lots of people that did all that. Yeah, it's sealed. That's why you don't mm -hmm. want to sand it. Yeah. Yeah, and you don't really have to. I mean, gesso goes over the... I've gessoed those. I've used those boxes. I have tags with those boxes. So I figure I've covered up the carcinogen with enough layers that maybe I'm not going to, you know, have to worry about. All right, so I like that. And then I was just like, you know, it's just covering up so much over here. And then I, I don't know, I was just mussing about and, hey, check it out. Hey, Mo, I'm glad it's you and not, you know, fake you just hanging out. <laughs> it's just, hello, everyone. I'm here for real now. <laughs> I don't know who that other Mo that was maybe here. <laughs> well, her, hey, you should, you should, you should, shouldn't be cavalier about that because you know sometimes That's people true. take over your identity and, uh, yeah. and and But I can change this and put this on the back here, yeah. which is very cool. And then you you're, you're surprised when you turn it over. You're going, oh my gosh, look, granny flowers. But here's See, the thing: not, they not, don't, they don't 
hit on this side because this is the opposite. Okay, so this is the crazy stuff that I like think about all the time. So here's some fun little facts about the magnets and if you wish to like have even more movement. So what you could do is whenever you're putting them down there, you could make it to where, so right now I think if you, even if you spun the old lady flowers around on that panel, yeah, they, they still work. stick. Yeah. No matter which way you put it. Doesn't but if matter. You would have, if I would have flipped them and made them opposite, then you could you give it gives you even more option. But it only allows you then to connect it the one way, but you would be able to flip you could put the other side on that side, but turned around. Yeah. Does that make sense? And I see mean, this goes on the back and I think so that's this pretty way. Cool. It's one or the, like, you can put it on the back side or you can put it on the front side. But if you flip those magnets, then you would have more options. Like, you could put that side over there uh -huh. on that side, but it would be turned around. There you go. Yep. Well, we did some of that with that one thing that you did. Yes. The twirly thing. Yes. God, this I don't even remember that. But here's what I thought. I thought this would be a perfect surface here. Mm -hmm for the writing, right? Yes. Yeah, and then you'd get to see all this lusciousness of, um, yeah, pencil work mm -hmm. that I've done around the edge. But it all started out when I went around the edge with the, um, because I wanted to bring in more of that kind of golden color there rather than that really um, bright, limey green. green, limey yeah. green. Mm -hmm. Although I do have bright limey green in there in places. And then I went ahead and I went over the flower petals again with the... Yes, you want to make sure, and that's why, um, so in the demonstration, uh, I did that yesterday, Devin, at the beginning of yesterday's stream. Uh, I, well, actually, you know, I did that. I showed the whole process of gluing them down. But as you're placing them, you know, you can kind of play around with that. Okay, so back behind me here, and you know, I, I know that there's a whole whole group of people out there. Well, when we went to Baltimore, there were these people that they, they saved all their um, pull-off paint strips, you know. I just saved these because I thought they were really exceptional. I, most of them I just wad up and throw away. I might, you know, start actively save, Hello, paint works. saving more of those. And this is just, I just have them on the deli paper. But this is going to have to be attached somehow to the structure of the book, yep. the accordion book, right? Yes. But look at this. I think this side, this is the back that side. that stuff that she was like, I don't know why people save this. Yeah. She saved it. Hinge it. And look, I've got a hinge for the other side too because you double side them, or at least I think you should double side them. Uh, the anything front and the back. wise I do, yeah, because even yeah. if it's only slightly sticky, it's still sticky in them. But look at that. Doesn't that just go together? I don't think so, but... If you do, I'm with you. Well, the, the red's a little murdery and kind of screams out at me. Well, I know you got red on your on your flowers, but it's well, just, I could it's, use this side. This is a little more subdued. Well, then the blue screams at me. Oh Lord! Sorry. Well, I'm I'm going to use burst in your tape bubble. <laughs> I'm going to use those. And um. <laughs> oh, here, most is satisfying your twinge by adding a hinge. Yeah, there is that. So anyway, that's how that's going to be attached. So then we're to the next part of this little discussion that we're having here. Discussion we're having here. Mm -hmm. Because I already have some pages that I've made, right? Just because we couldn't, we, me. Mm -hmm. All just, of us together. Yeah, just, you know, I just jump right into it. That's how I do things. A lot of people, you know, sit back and contemplate things and whatnot. But I like to, I like to just, you know, go ahead and jump right in and learn how to do it as I go. That that's my feeling. So you can see right away that these are not necessarily going to work per se per page here. Number one, they're either too wide or too short. Isn't that the way life is? Side too matters. whatever. But you can see that they can be adapted just by the page that you decide to put them on. And I don't know if you remember. Hi, Carla. Um, Mariah is 
uh, doors available over there readily. I, I can't remember if I hauled off with doors or not. What are you talking about doors? Doors. The, the, the book, Doors. I did doors. Oh, that's what you call that thing? Uh-huh. Yeah, well, it's doors. Celestial. Celestial doors. Uh-huh. See, she knows where stuff is. Good Lord, I'd have been over there 15 minutes I'm a, trying to I'm find. a librarian. She's the librarian. <laughs> As long as, the card as long as she on puts in the right search term. Obviously, see, that first one wasn't clicking. <laughs> wasn't clicking. Okay, so this started out. Remember this one? This started out as a accordion. But it morphed into um, a gatefold and then a gatefold within a gatefold. Yes, just because it wasn't working. And that's what I always encourage. You know, don't... Bye, Trish batter your brain against the wall and try to force something. But try to consider, I gotta get rid of this because I keep hitting my mm -hmm. arm on that thing there. So this just became a a flop open. <laughs> Were y'all ready for that? What? If you haven't seen this one, I'm sure that was like a, what? <laughs> it has a, it, <laughs> it's it verbal. holds a lot of stuff. Look at this. And this was what it was for. It was for the tag journal. And this was one of those projects that was just went on and on. It did. Go on and on and on. Hey, check this out. Mo, I don't know if you if, if you were there for this original, but remember all those cool things that you yes, said? Yes, you watched me? back. Yeah. Because I kind of remember I listed her. them what they are, so if I want to order any more, I can. And down here is the little thing She's that so you're cute. I won't show everybody because it's got your address on it off of the Hi, envelope look at that cute little pocket and then on this side this yeah. is all from the tissue paper um, that Mo sent the stuff in that Mo sent the stuff in because it just cracked me up maybe worrying about it will help good for your bum great for the world who gives a crap <laughs> More people have mobile mobile phones than toilets. Yes, this journal heavily features Christie's uh, <laughs> Celestial Gateway stencil. Yeah, like almost exclusively. In its myriad of forms. Look at that. Is that? Five by seven. How beautiful. I need to scoot that over because it's behind our head. Oh, look at you looking at that. Isn't that beautiful? And here's that stuff that All right, Carla. sent me, that netty stuff that doesn't tear. But it cuts and it and it sews really well. This is my sewy. I sewed here. Here's this is how I sew. Sewy. It's sewy. It's whip stitchy. Yeah. And I just make it up as I go. You can see how I I can't follow a pattern to save my life. Well she could, but then she'd be angry. Well, I wouldn't be able I would never finish anything. No. Because that's You were like, okay, I got that. I mean, yeah, I got that. Okay, let's move on. Do something now. The, this is some this is the little, um, this yes. is just a real memorabilia little booklet. Because this is the little yes. little flower that um, Violet gave us. And then I crocheted this other little piece using the string that Mo sent me. And it, look at that patina on that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Eat your heart out, Seth Aptar. I'm calling you out, Sethy. Calling you out, Sethy. Because he watches all the time. Yeah, he does. Runs right over there every day. <laughs> Here. Hey, Eddie. I mean, I swear, if, if he ever comes back and leaves the comment, we're going to feel like real asses, but that's all right. I'm okay with that. I, I'm okay with that, too. Hey, Eddie, check it out. <laughs> Here's the dude. It says, man is least himself when he take, talks in his own person. Give him a mask and he will tell you the truth. Oscar Wilde. But I cut this it's out. It's Pedro! <laughs> <laughs> I think, I think Eddie started hanging out with us right about this time. <laughs> and and um, I don't know who it was. I said, well, and then Wendy I says, put a face on the other side. They said, that doesn't make it any better. <laughs> no. said, yeah, okay. Yeah. No. And, like, and then Wendy goes, horny man. <laughs> His horns were removed. Yeah. Yes. And then he became Pedro. <laughs> then he became Pedro. With his, my eyes look like that today. Okay, <laughs> we should I'm, put some glasses on him. And I grommeted the crud out of this. And look at the stitchery here. And then it has weaving on it. I mean, this is like the quintessential. It has everything. 
-hmm. mixed media. And this is the actual stencil with a piece of paper is glued he, down behind it. I don't, did we talk about Pedro in the PMisms? Maybe. I don't know. I can't Mo, remember. I'm putting that on Mo. Like, if she gave that information to me, probably. If not, he should be. We will. And this is from Violet also. Look at this sweet little little card that she sent. And then I took mm -hmm. her little flower that she... And look, at it has a little twisty thing here. Oh, and that's, um, that's oh, On Sharon's. the back it says crocheted flowers and stars. And Violet's little message is back there. And that's the Firebird. Yeah, and this is the Firebird. Okay. All right, I, I think that, that that's... And I have to remember how to put this back together, you know, as an order. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. That's kind of, you know, I'm chuckling about that. Yeah. And this is my very carefully crocheted. Mm -hmm. um, I like this because you, then you can just stick the horn in here anywhere. There's this horn. The One of them. Of the horn. And, you know, if it gets it's like fat, a trophy. If, if, it, if it loses weight. You can adjust it. Goes keto. You know, and it, you'd have some more stuff to put in it. You can, yeah. All, All right. right. There so you go. I'm just that is an example of this is where we are right now with the book. Is this where we're going to be? Um, ten days from now, you know about I, as much about that as I do. I love that you put that time frame on it. Yeah. 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 I, I'm time framing it. So, let's just go ahead, because the thing is, is you just have, you have to start somewhere. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's check our, the other thing I like about gesso, it dries really fast. Okay, look, we've got, this is good. Very little warpage there. Very pleased with that. And, and good we, coverage. Yeah, and good single, Yeah. because I, I you don't that. have to have it where everything goes away because you know that you're going to put stuff on top of it. But it's nice to have that plain surface to work with when you're deciding what you're going to put on it. Mm -hmm. All right, let's look at skinny cheese. It's okay. Well, look, we're getting a little... A little warpy. A little warpy. And I was kind of afraid of that because it is, it's, it's much thinner. Yeah. But I think that this is still going to work for an interior page. I just, I will use... The um, heavier duty. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Is this business days? Are we talking business ten business days? Or t <laughs> oh my God, who said that? Yeah, there's sir. It, it, it even says ten <laughs> days only. I, I'm highly doubtful. <laughs> <laughs> it's under horny man. Yes, Eleni Zazani. Mm -hmm. I say Ellen Eleni. Yeah, Eleni. That's what I say. She says it's correct. Okay, Eleni. Okay. Thank you, Star Traveler. Hello, yeah. Anina. You have come back. <laughs> yeah, I know. Doubting, just, doubting Thomas things. is, yeah, that has biblical mm -hmm. references, which is apropos since we are talking about, you know, mm -hmm. deities here. <laughs> Okie dokie. So, we know Cheez Its is going to have, Cheez Its is going to have to be an interior page. And I was, Mariah and I had this discussion and she said, it's so weird that you, you would you would bring this up because I, I, I laid awake last night thinking about it and I, I really, I wish you'd, you know, if I had my phone by my bed, you could call me in the middle of the night and we could have a chit chat. <clears throat> but I don't. If she had her phone on. <laughs> if I had my phone on, period. Well, I, today, I I mean, I was, I, Mariah got me up at eight o'clock. Oh, the... yeah. Oh, no. Actually, it was earlier than that. 8 o'clock. It was about 7.30. 7.30. And I grabbed my phone because I thought, well, if I decide, you know, I, I, I don't want to oversleep. So, I, I need, and my phone is dead. So, I had to come back upstairs and get my charger. And then I was downstairs and I was hanging you know, out. With these and I absolutely fell asleep sitting up <laughs> because I was so tired. And that could explain some of the bags under my eyes. Yeah. Okay. Now, let's talk. Let's get back to this and, sh you know, sh shut up all this. Yeah. Yimmer yammer. Hoopty doo yimmer yammer. The thing about this is when you're designing these accordion books, you can get all kinds of weird shapes and whatever. But what you want to remember is the sides that go together in the fold need to meet up. 
somewhere. It don't have to be, you know, like. You don't have to be perfect, but you need some good hinging. You, you need a. It fair, really hinges on the you book. Need, you need a fairly straight on <laughs> edge to, you know, tape to. That this kind of <laughs> stuff exactly. is a little bit difficult. And we also want to consider. He is very Ringo. Because one of the ways that we talked about putting these in is to go ahead and bind it there. <laughs> Christopher says that uh, when he falls asleep sitting up, he calls it deep thinking. Deep thinking? Carmichael said he's dressing his eyes. Yeah, my father used to say, I'm listening to that. <laughs> like you were snoring. <laughs> I, <laughs> you the I was listening to that. I'm like, yeah, you only notice like you've been, you, like, <laughs> it was like 20 minutes. <laughs> All right. Now, remember, I wrote myself little notes here on my my mock-up about things I'm going to do but the one thing that you see this little thing right here yeah that's <laughs> a little, uh -huh. I made it a little bigger because I thought the first one was too small <laughs> size matters size matters is this is this your little hook your your oh, this is orifice go, this is going to be it and I might even make it a bit more because I'm just thinking about you know, I want, I, I actually want to have something there that I can sew on so it's not always falling off. Because that's so irritating. Keep it up with the, the things. What's, pardon me, is. the wraparound. Sometimes they just, you mm -hmm. know, it's just better if you go ahead. And, and then I, I got to looking at this and I was thinking, you know, that kind of looks like. Yep. It's horny, of, man. I don't know. He just keeps coming up. Pedro just keeps popping up. Pedro keeps popping up. Bless his little darling heart. And then I thought, well, you know, I really need, I need more width here anyway. Okay. So what I should do is just go ahead and extend this out more this way so it's yeah. going to match up with the back one. Right? Yeah. I mean, why not? So I can just go ahead and I can go <laughs> ahead. Now, I do think I am going to leave a tiny bit more here because I want to be able to see that second page. Hello, Marguerite. Even when the front page is closed, because that's the whole idea of the layering of the, you know, the offsetting of mm -hmm. the pages and why I colored them different colors. I mean, that's, I just did that so that you could actually visually see that. Yeah. Okay, so this page would actually <laughs> fall, come back this way. And this, this is the spread that you have here. So this is the back side of the second page that you're going to be seeing. Mm -hmm. This is very complicated. Accordions can be very complicated. And the thing about it is I know that I'm making it a lot more complicated than it really seems. She's really good at that. I, I am good at that. And I, <clears throat> I complicate and, and talk myself out of things. So the best thing to do here is I'm going to use Summit for front and back. Wonderful. All right, everybody. It's really good cereal, by the way. I don't eat it anymore, but. Oh, it really is yummy. Look at all the stuff it's got. <laughs> it has um, almonds, cereal flakes, pumpkin seeds, dried cranberries, and dried cherries. And then I just grab a handful of the mixed nuts and throw it in to augment whatever, you know, you I know, didn't get. You nuts. Yeah. Yeah. In case you're not getting enough nuts. Yeah. I'm big on nuts. I, I think they're a good source of protein and whatnot. Now, I do, yep. I am going to keep these because I think I might have some doors within, in. I don't know. I will address that at a later date. As Mariah says, right now what I need to focus on most is getting the pages and building it out. Because you can always do the decorative yep. part. Now, here's the other thing we talked about. Because I do want to use, and I'm going to use, <laughs> yes, Ellen, puzzle throughout on that top part. Oh, do you know where your puzzle's at? I found it by golly. Now I might need to have a new one because my puzzle's in. It's old. It's very old. Is it an OG? Oh yeah, <clears throat> I think that's an original. And I, I. I, I probably She's need scavenged. another one of these because I took this apart for some project. I can't remember why yeah. I did that. But this is this is too big. 
I have That's to have that. twelve. I need the smaller one. Well, what's the smaller one? Eight by ten or I five need, by seven? I need this one in this size. Because, see? Oh, I don't really. I can probably move that around and make it work. But I do love that, too. So and what then, you're asking for is kind this of is like, something, well... I like this one, too. But this hey, is... Hey, hold on a second. Marketing yeah. department would like to talk to you. Oh, Lord. Uh, <laughs> so basically what she's asking for is like a puzzle special. A puzzle special. I want this one. Remember how we did... Um, Geo Poly, like it started out as like a big version and then people saw the one that you had which was a special which was smaller version in big form. Like, okay, this is a puzzle but which one is this one? I like this one also. That? Except this one doesn't have as big a holes. I really need puzzles. Lip Blop Rocks. This is Lip Blop Rocks? Yep. Oh, okay. Well, I like it but the holes get clogged up. Yes. A lot easier. Okay, so this is the one that I need in the big size, but I really want, what's the difference between these two? <laughs> oh, sis, the puzzle has always been special. Here's the link. <laughs> I, I'm puzzled about why this puzzle doesn't look the same as that puzzle. Well, because Mo actually was the original sort of requester of a special. So we used to do these 4 by 11 for her, because remember she made that cute book, the oh, baby book. that, yes. And so she wanted puzzle, and I think one other one. It's when she longer. used the, yeah. the bright yellow. So we did that for Mo. Um, and we do take special requests. We don't these days they're harder to do, but. And, and depending on the, um, okay. But what I would really like is I'd really like this one. Or no, sorry, that was like a 4 by I don't know. It's four by six or something like that. Yeah, it was some 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 size that. Um, but we do a, a four by eleven, a really long one in some of these. So I could get you that because I'm pretty sure we did it with the puzzle. Okay, so what I really want is I want this mm -hmm. exact same size. Yeah, but, but uh, uh, more but of it. Yeah, I want more of it. So we could do one special one. I don't want to do it in 8x10 or anything like that where we just make it a 9x12 special puzzle. That's just the small, because it's going to take me a while. I have to, there, that's not a step and repeat, so I have to go in and build it out and make it look like, you know, it's all melded together. Okay, raise your hand if you're interested. <laughs> special puzzle? Special puzzle. Okay. I'm interested in a special puzzle. And we might be able to work something out on the jean patching. The jeans do need to be patched because let me tell you, as cold as this is right now, the jeans with a hole in it, mm -mm. Okay, now I really honestly think that I can make this one work. Because see what I did to this one is I just took off that part and right, made we, this edge. Hello, Apple. And we got a question. Yeah. Kelly asked, which side of the stencil goes on the plate? Oh, when you're starting out, the one that has the little cuppies on it. So when you feel the ridges, does that go up or down? Goes down on the okay. first one. The ridges, so you'll feel it. Yeah, like on this one. I don't know if you can see you can you can even see it. How it's gathered in there. That the white part of this goes down, right? Goes down. Yeah. See, and you can see that that's how it was used. And it's not terribly, terribly noticeable. You just have to really you can feel it more than you can see it. But you can feel that okay. little ridge. And the reason you want to put it down on your plate is because that little ridge goes mm. onto your plate and you're going to mm. get a beautiful smooth this is why when I do those long hauls I love a new stencil because that's why that yeah, works, works so, so well, well mm -hmm. is because it's or you could wash your stencils and clean them or you could wash them and then know? each and every time you can long haul as much as you want you can't all right I'm going to leave this one out and you know hold off on that special order <laughs> Because I'm not even sure I'm going to need it. And we didn't get a whole lot of people raising their hands. Yeah, we did. There's there's a few in there. Okay. And, and I don't think that's a bad idea, personally. Okay. But see, I want, I want to have different colors of stuff here. <laughs> but what I want is I want this texture paste to be on every page. That's the unifying... That's the little red thread. The, the little, little red thread. Common throughout. Yes. I think it was Ann Lauper who told us about that. That was a lovely way of saying mm -hmm. that. 
Alrighty, then we've got I've got that. I'm gonna leave that out, put that right there. <laughs> Wendy said, I didn't realize I had a vote on the stencils. Yeah, I mean if you guys are here, it matters. Oh, it does. Yeah, it does. All right, this is really cool because I can just put this underneath here and trace <laughs> around it. Don't Pedro. What? I think there were Pedros in Puzzle. There, there's some definite Pedro-esque. Oh, yeah. He he pops up all he, over. Yeah, he does. He it raises his head on all mm -hmm. kinds of occasions. All right, now I'm just, you know, I'm going to take artistic license here because I can. And I'm looking underneath. Yeah, okay. And I'm going to say that I'm going to sh make this come out ever so slightly and not just be, you know, so straight here. Right. Uh, okay. Yeah, and, and more angular. More angular and less. Yeah. And then I'm going to come back in here and I'm going to pretty much adhere to what I've got here because, oops, I know that is going to hook up over here. Pequeño Pedro. <laughs> and this is going to be a place where it can join here and here. Now I'm going to lose this little funky stuff here, which I could go ahead and just um I uh, yes, but Ricky, I'll put them in I'll put them in chat right now. I think I put them in the journal making. Okay, so thing. this is going to be this is going to be a hole. This up here is 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 going to be attached. That's going to be a place of attaching to the other to provide for more stability. Because these guys just hanging out up there, yeah, that's not going to work very well. Okay, there we go. Numero uno. Numero uno. Numero uno. Pedro's cousin has been formed. <laughs> And one of the things that, you know, oh, this is just, I, I really wanted to save that piece, but it binds my scissors, so I've got to yeah. cut it. That's all right. That could, that could be a tag. It's very stiff. Sometimes Pedro is. And, you know, because there's not a real big hope to do here. about, you know, exactness, yeah. except when I go over here. That's going to be kind of exacting. All right, I'm binding. Oh, wonderful. So they are in the um, in the shop. Awesome. I, I've been really trying to, I, I was good. I went back after uh, Darcy was so kind. She, she reminded me, and so I added the glue, and then I was like, oh, well, shoot, you know, maybe I should just make a whole section of things that could, you know, prep or bind. I did put the texture gesso in the kind of medium and glues adhesives. And some things there's like crossover in the different categories that I've created over there on the Amazon shop. Do you want me to do that? Well, if I can't do it, I'm gonna, I'll hand okay. it off. I really wanted some of those X-Acto knives that <laughs> swiveled. That was a very good word, Marguerite. What did you say? You're just going to have to read it and check. Cause I think, you know, I, I'm pushing the limits today anyway. <laughs> did you read it? No, I, 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 there was too much there. I'm okay. <laughs> Wendy says that p 8 p.m. Chat is like reviving, reliving my teenage years as a mature woman. And she... Well, you know, er, aubergine isn't that what it is? An aubergine. aubergine. I love aubergine. Aren't they? Uh, that's an eggplant, right? It's the color purple. Yes. I, I love that color. It's 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 kind of dirty. Well, you know, probably there's a whole whole lot of people that are going. You know, it that's really doesn't have to be that complicated. Nope. But I'm telling you what, this is some this is some stiff stuff. Stiff stuff. Right here, folks. And hopefully that's going to cut off there. Mm -hmm. You cut what you can with scissors because I'm a lot better with scissors than I am with... If it sticks out, cut it off. If it sticks out, cut it off. Well, you want to be careful about that. 
It's a general kind of a, rule. It's si not a situational. <laughs> yeah. Call there. Right, yeah. And if it's somebody else's, you need to ask before you yeah, start really. cutting things off. <laughs> if it's on you or yours, you just you know that's you. Alrighty, there we go. <laughs> Hallelujah, page number one. Mm -hmm. Ladies and gents, and let's put it down here and see how we like it. Let's audition. Okay. All right, Paula. And if you need to go to go to bed, you can. All right. So I'm looking here, and I'm thinking, you know, I need to take some more out of this, or I need to cut some more off of here. And I think I'll just go ahead and. Uh, Yanka, I think sometimes what happens, like in the other countries, is if there is a link to that product that is in your country, Amazon, um, it will. But um, I typically don't get it. Like, okay, it depends perfect. on the country. See how that, uh, pardon me, follows that line up there? Yeah, and Mo, I don't think that we get the, the UK stuff. Even though, like, I set it up to be open to other, I think, if there is a link to the similar, or that same brand, that same product on a Amazon, like a, a different country's Amazon, then it will. But the crossover is pretty small on a lot of the brands. Yeah, and, and that's, you know, it kind of makes you a little bit irked, but. Well, I mean, it makes sense. All Hi, right, Gretchen. here we go. Page two. Cheese it. Cheese it. Cheese it. We're going to cheese it. <laughs> Be really irked if this doesn't work. <laughs> irked. Irked. All right, now this is a little... Okay. What was your thought there? Okay. Here, here's the thing. Okay. I need... I need this here to match up here, not here. But I need it to match up in both places. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my little handy dandy, you know, ruler, 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 do here. And remember, we decided we wanted it to. We, we need for this. It, it it doesn't have to be exact. All right. But it sure is nice if it's straight. So it's helpful. I'm going helpful. 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 <laughs> I'm going to go ahead. Oh, and I'm not you know, required. I need, need to get rid of both. Of, okay, sorry. It's kind of like Mariah and the wah. Here we go with Mr. Chopper. She means the 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 um heat gun. That's what the wah is. If y'all don't know. <clears throat> We're just going to get rid of that little... Yes, that is ridgy. correct. No. That's Rid my understanding. What is it? She says that usually the, link, the, the links will convert to the country. But yes, our store is like U.S. Because that's... It bases it from our account. Alright, now... Before I put... Mr. Guillotine away. Is oh, that... Susan, well, you got to go over there and read the PMisms, but you got to go to Horny Man. All right, well, that's and that'll get you note up. A little bit off, but it's a little bit off anyway, so we're just going to go with it. All right, so that's that. This is this page right here. Yes. <laughs> and we can turn this over like this and. Oh, I need. Thank you, Darcy. Yes, and there's the blog. It should be like in the top, like five. Like when you go over there to the blog, it'll be yes. All right, I don't have to. I try to keep it towards the top anymore off of that. So oh, just, there's right. Mo's got a direct link to it. Okay. So basically, I want this. I'm very proud of you with this. Uh, hey, I have spent a long time thinking about this. And even though, you know, it's like not FP, 
but you see how I had to come in and I'm not I'm just gonna that's got to go that little thing up there and in, in this instance F stands for functionally perfect yes also a fun word fun fun or fancy pants that okay. is another fp and here we're going to go out to Bye, this Monica. edge right there because we know that's that is where my fold was yes right there and if you want once you start connecting you could make that connection back you can or it would just kind of meet up i think that would be more interesting yeah probably and you can kind of decide as you go along now i don't want to put that I lost that thing the other <laughs> other day. Potatoes. I don't know about. Now, cheese it should cut a whole lot easier than. Yes. Oh yeah, this is like butter compared mm -hmm. to that other. Or like cheese. Which cheese it's are like cheese? They are not cheese. <laughs> Those of you that have come in here, do say hello in the chat so we can say hello back. Otherwise, we do not know that you are here. If you are seeing the live chat. That means you are in the live stream. We are live. Otherwise, you will have access to the comments below, which we would very much appreciate you leaving one. And if you haven't given the thumbsy upsy, please do so. Yeah. Yeah. And really, you know, this there wasn't any rhyme or reason to this edge that I have going here. I just wanted it to be more organic than um, geometric. <laughs> What? Carl is this so the cheese it reminds me of an episode of Modern Family. I loved Modern Modern Family. Gloria had tried to order Jay a box of baby cheeses, but what she got instead was an, a box of nativities, baby Jesus. Because <laughs> she had an accent, you know? Uh -huh. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> oh, that is that is too funny. Okay, I, I have another Jesus Jesus story for you. Oh, um, the third graders came in the door right next to my art room, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. From outside recess. So this little girl came in, and I was just watching from my room, and she came running up, and she said, Mrs. Carmichael, Mrs. Carmichael, Jesus left his lunchbox on the playground. <laughs> hey, Sus. Hey, Sus. Jesus left his, Jesus left his lunchbox on the playground. He's always doing stuff like that, you know? <laughs> oh, dang it. Jesus. We'll give him a pass. <laughs> He's got other things on his mind. <laughs> okay. So, here we go. Hey, this is really taking form. I, I <laughs> Literally and figuratively. Here we go. Look at that. I'm very impressed. And then we've got this side over here. Now, I kind of want that one to curve just a little bit more. I'll tell you, this bracelet and the scarf, they just, they like each other a lot. Just a little little nippy there. Oh, curve it. Where? Oh, at the top here. Yes. Just chop that off so that that. Well, continues. it just curves. I think it just needs a curve. Well, let's put it down and see. Okay, see you don't. This is not. Oh, here we go. Yeah, <laughs> that does need to be nipped. Did you look in the lunch nipped boxes? It, so nip and people want to know what was in the lunch box. I I, I don't know. No, didn't know. Do not know. Do not know. Okay, I've got to get rid of some of this stuff. That's this a is... funny one today. Yeah. Jesus. And well, then we have cheese on trees for the chorizo. Yeah, so we're always hollering upstairs because, you know, like, you don't have to walk up here and talk to her. And so sometimes when you're hollering at her and depending on, you know, her allergies and hearing and whatever. Yeah, and that kind of stuff. So we asked her, do you want some chorizo and eggs? And she said, cheese on trees. I said, last time I, I don't want any cheese on trees. Because I, I Izzy calls broccoli. Yeah. Trees. She thought that, like, and I'm kids, just like, you know. Yeah, I kind of like my bro broccoli plain. Mm -hmm. and so, yeah, that's, that's a, a little funny. Mm -hmm. they, they use that one all the time. Okay, this is, I need to write on this right now. And I, I would have Hello, gone sorry. to, this is the back cover because remember this is the strong and it has to be this big because it's got to match up 
and you may laugh like really why do you have to to um to mark it when you're doing an accordion especially if you're doing a square one when all the panels are the same I, it is important to mark it it really and you is. might even say this side up <laughs> because yes. what which one did we do that it, we, all right so this is funny all right so tutu she was doing her her cards and she she put one of her backs on upside down she's like well if you flip it like this then it's fine <laughs> i totally understand that totally understand that i got a journal i got a journal, journal. that this this got it that flip, situation all flips, over it flips up uh, up and down and pukes out cards and and i practiced it and practiced it and i never got it right in the you know actual video that like i could open it and do it properly because it took a little flipping and you know i had convinced myself that it was all like meant to be it, it really isn't it's not intuitive no no it is not all right here we go we're on to page number oh and i need to trim off that stuff i I'm not to do that. <laughs> yes, exactly. Mark it so that way, yeah, you don't have to worry about remembering. Well, and I will use it up and then I'll be angry because I don't have another one that's that stiff. I'm hello, Kathy. That's pretty good. I don't really think I'm going to have to. I think to. another Kathy came in. I just never know which edge I'm going to use, and that's kind of a crap edge. And yeah. That's why. Because we need to sharpen our blades. We got dull blades here, folks. We need to find somebody. Okay. What? How? How am I doing here? Oh, yeah. I haven't really given you a time thing. No, huh? you haven't. You usually do that right away. About forty-five uh, minutes. Okay. So we've got one, two. See, this is minutes. where. This is where you can get yourself into some trouble here. Because now. This is the one that I need to do. That's sweet, Julie. And I can always make slight adjustments on the bottom. Oh, look at that. That's coming out perfectly with my... Oh, yes. There's probably some kind of... Uh, I'll, I'll screw it up somewhere. <laughs> Stay tuned, y'all. Stay tuned. Oh, my gosh. Back cover. Back <laughs> Back, 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 <laughs> you evil thing. Okay. Oh, that's awesome. Sorry, she, she, she's exercising while listening to us. Oh, well, that, that's a good thing to do. It is. When it gets, uh, when it warms up, we'll, we'll continue walking again, but uh, it, it's too cold. Kissy face too. Oh goodness. Well, Izzy would love to be there, Susan. I tell you, that kid, she was so excited about that very uh, sad situation of snow. I mean, seriously. Okay, now that one comes out, but I think that that's going to be okay. It was in the book. Oh, uh, this is this is where you can really like majorly. That's why I said you need to start getting to the point where you start binding them because you're not gonna necessarily. Oh, you know what you need to do? You need to number your panels on your mock-up. Then you need to number those boards. You think that'll help? I do. Well, I'm gonna listen to you because I don't have any. Well, I think we can pretty much get this is this is front. Yeah, but okay, front. So that's one. All right, now, is this going the right way? That's why I said you need to go yes, one, two, three, and put your two on the side that you see. see. Well, I will know because that's always the, um, I, I will do the side that I can see on rather than the, you know. Darcy says the hole is supposed to match up, <coughs> she thought. <clears throat> well, she kind of nipped it, so it may not be exactly the way it was on no. the thing. She nipped okay. it. Okay, so. It was sticking out. 
this actually and see I, i'll take this away mm -hmm. this actually okay it's going to hook up to this one on this side but then this side over here is going to hook up to this side and see well, no, they're not no. exactly coming to the same spot there but you know you can fix stuff like that i don't know that that's whoa 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 whoa, whoa. yeah Okay, here we are. Yeah. We're all, we're all, we're already. Yes, going. exactly. All right, so this goes to this side. It opens up like this. Then you're right. This side gets hooked up here. So take that two, number 2 off of there. So get, or you you need to lay them out so it's 1 2 3 4. So that way when you put them together, they are in line. Then it, if 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 there are 4, then on the back side you go 5 6 7 8. Who do we appreciate? And turn. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Then why isn't this coming out at the right spot there? Oh, it will. Well, you haven't cut it yet. I haven't cut it yet, but okay. So I did need to do this. I need to re... re two is the problem, child. Uh-huh. Flip two. She needed to flip the two, but yeah, I think we got it. But then I need some, uh, this needs to be a, a negative space here, and somehow or other this needs to connect down here. So that I have another okay. point of connection. Okay. Right? Sure. Then this will hook on to page four. This is where page four hook up. Well, if you just if you numbered it four, that seems like it would be logical. No, this is three. Right, but it would be logical that number four would come after three. Oh. Yeah. Well, I know, but the hookup. See, it's this side rather than this side. And that's where mm. you get into the whole, mm, that's not working. Okay. Your brain. Okay, so now... Okay. Where's the one? Uh, where's your cover? And I want to know which side the cover, because that, okay, front. No, no, no. Then you're not numbering properly. Then. Why am I not numbering properly? Because if that, if you want the inside to be, the inside summit side should be one. And then put your number, and point to it. Front should just be front. Take that number one off of there. Front is front. Front. Yes. Take the number one off of there, please. This is, this is for me. This may not be for you, but it's for me. Okay, now flip it back over. And now number one goes there and then put your arrow connect, you know. No, that that's still two. It's this always is gonna one. Be, yep. And see the summit thing's even pointing over it. And that's still two. Just, just put your two back on there. Yep, still two. So one, two, and that's why, because when you open it up, you want it to have it like numbered. So then you have front, that's fine. Yeah, and then this is going to be like this. Yes. Yeah. Okay. I, Sherry, it, it's the accordion <sighs> Especially when real. you're going weird here. Yes. If they're all the same yeah. panel size, it isn't, as it big isn't of a, deal. a big deal. It's mainly just best to like figure out which side is up and down. Because that's confusing too. Yeah, that could be a, that could be. A, I, I can remember when that came up. Yeah, yeah. Okay, back to it. Now, do I need to before I, I cut here? I told her that, Lynn. I told her that this morning. What? I said it's really best if you would bind them as you go, because then you don't have to worry about if you you know not putting the right thing together. But the problem is, is that. There's still some stuff that has to happen here, and then we can make it pretty or prettier. Yeah, and I'm if they out, are still in panels. I'm out of. I need more cardboard. I don't have any more cardboard to make oh. more pages with, because my other pages are too short. Okay. Well, where's? Do, do you have it cut up, or do you? I, I mean, I can't no, imagine. No, I, I don't. I, I don't. I physically do not have a piece oh. because it's all in the garage. Let me go get that for you, honey. You just, you just talk to the people, and I, I'm going to be right Reach back. Out. Okay, turn two over, Kathy says. Okay, I'm hiding myself here. There we go. 
I shall be right back. Oh, bless your heart. You're absolutely right. This is the side that hooks up. Okay, so same size hook. Because look, see, there's our, our thing. Dear Lord. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you. Whoever said that, I didn't. Okay, turn page two over, please. Kathy, thank you. I did. I did it. And you know what I might do here? I might take some of that crap tape and just go ahead and keep these, you know, like temporarily together. What do you think? Thank you for that. But, you know, I was just, sometimes it's the most obvious things that you're just like, oh, holy moly. And I'm really not too, I, that shape there, I'm going to have to make one side a little bit different than the other one because it's just a little bit too um, cutesy. Okay, and then this side is going to go here, right? Okay, that comes down a lot lower there, but I don't know. <clears throat> Okay, see, I made that to go with that. Now I need to make this go with this. Okay. Okay, I think we've got it straightened out here, Mariah. I'm taping them together um, temporarily. Wonderful. I like this idea. And I'm needing to do something a little bit different here. Okay. Let's just erase this line. See, this you you think you've got it figured out when you're you're doing this here, but yeah, she needs to leave a little bit of a a gutter. Okay, so I can have this come down. Yes, the crap tape. <laughs> that 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 seems to be part of today's word and so maybe we can go ahead and have this line here and then that cut out there let's see how that works <laughs> is that how they go that's how they would go together right Yes, because this is going to go back this way rather than this. I'm sorry. I know you all. I Hey, I, 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 I'm proud of you, actually. Like, thank you. I, normally, I'm I, the one I doing wouldn't this. have tackled this. And normally, we do this sort of thing like behind the scenes because sometimes it, it gets a little Yeah, I hate it. <laughs> hate it. <laughs> Y'all are being very kind in the chat. Thank you. <laughs> And I can just kind of re chat and be like, no, I think you should re chat. <laughs> oh, she would fix it and like it wouldn't be any big deal. I'm taking artistic license here and yeah. those little, you know, rounded out. Yeah, the marks are suggestive puffy, only. Puffy ball shapes mm -hmm. are being a little more squared off here. Well, and they'll get another trim up once papers and things start getting moved <coughs> down to them anyway. This is very true. Yeah, I, I, I told her that, Susan, that I said, you know, I think a lot of times, you know, we do this stuff off camera, and then you guys don't really get the full-on, like, hey, this is a planning session, too, because you got to kind of, like, well, yes, it worked out in the paper thing, but, you know, now we're cutting out pieces, and you got to put them together. Oh, that's a little different. <laughs> 
Oh, Ricky, you're so sweet. She says, let's face it, we could all use a Mariah and wow. in, our, in our back bedroom to come out and help when needed. <laughs> hey, we're accordioning in here, yeah, folks. You Look are. at that. All right. All right. Stick that one together. Stick them together. Now, I will probably help her with the, because I'll be doing the binding part, I would assume. All right, the reason I wanted these only temporarily done is because I'm going to texture paste these. And I wanted to do that and not have to worry about shutting the page and smushing yeah. the texture paste. Because, you know, that that is another mm -hmm. something to think about there, folks. <laughs> That's right. So she says the rubber is meeting the road. <laughs> I don't think so, Devin. What? She says, I feel like this is Echoes of Archie. Oh, Devin. as far as... Or, or do you feel like, um, as far as, like, the shapes and things? Oh, no. I don't, I don't think she means, like, she, it's going the way of Archie. This is Echoes of Archie. In oh, his, Echoes of... It looks like, sort of like yes. Archie. Uh-huh. Okay. Yeah, the shapes. Okay. Yeah, because around here... I thought you meant look like it's going to go on to the shelf. Yeah. Yeah, let's don't archie it. Yeah, I say don't archie it. Are you committed to this? <laughs> All right, let me reach down here and find another... Yes, Apple, you are here for the binding demo. This is the, the, the taking the mock-up to the next level, getting panels cut. Oh, my gosh, y'all remember this? Okay. I have a tag okay. from this. Okay, do not get all oh. nostalgic about that. Just, I see, this is why it's so hard to bring her out things. Now, this is another This is another good one, but see, look, it's already getting weirded out. Mm -hmm. Now, that piece I might still be able to use. I don't know, Mariah, this is not a... Well, let me tell you, it's very cold out in the garage, so I kind of grabbed the first thing that looked like cardboard stuff. So. Well, I'm not finding any suitable pieces here, I hate to say. No? I don't think that... I oh, make... man, this, these are some good chocolates. <laughs> Look, it has a little window in it. Even. It has a window in it, but it's it's not... You don't want to incorporate a window? Well, it's just not going to work. It's not tall enough, wide enough. Well, you know what I could do is I could just grab a piece of chipboard. I hate doing that because it's... Kind of a... Well, I mean, I think if you have exhausted your large cardboard stash... I have it well, exhausted. I've got lots of little pieces of cardboard. Uh-huh. And see, I've got this stuff here. And I make them break it down. That's This is that heavy duty. All right, well, <laughs> we'll just steal, <laughs> steal a piece of chip board that I happen to have only, you know, 49. I don't really even like chipboard, but, you know, it's hell of a, here we go. All right. Mm, so your crappy tape isn't sticking on the top first panel there. Well, of course it's not, because that's what it is. It's mm. crap tape. It's not even sticking on the bottom one either. is enjoying this very much. Oh, I'm about ready to, you know, scream. Get my god dang masking tape out, Mariah. Yeah. You could. I don't think it would hurt anything. Alright, so now the next side we're matching up to is this one. Mm -hmm. So I've got my pattern down there. I have to flip my book. I'll tell you what, this if you're going to do Hi, it this Eleni. way, this little mock-up thing here. Yeah. I'm, I mean, you know, it isn't spot on. But it was a good, like, step one and gave a lot of, you know, hey. Information. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yes, I mean. Deb says she needs better crap tape. <laughs> I do. It's not. I need one level up on sticky. They really should have, like, levels of sticky. Okay, now what I need here, and I keep losing my pencil. And the funny thing is, is so I order the washi tape like in all the rainbow colors, 
it's very interesting to me that in the same set of stuff that some is more sticky than others. All right, now I want to stick to this side, right? Oh, Lord Almighty, I tell you what, this is just getting on my very last. All right, well, uh, M.A., hello and welcome. Hello. I don't know if you are in the live live part. If you can let me know here in the chat that you've heard me, um, then I will explain. Lord I don't know if she might be here earlier in the stream, too. Because <clears throat> I need to be able to flip this. See, Tana says she's a visual engineer. Who is? Tana. I, I, this is the only, I, I, I can't, I, I know that there are people out there that do, are able to make, you know, this. Yes, for levels of sticky, for sure. Okay. All right, now that's staying together. And I don't know why this other one's sticking, to stay together, but it is fairly well. So, all right. I've got my straight side here, which is going to match up to the next page, but this is the side that I need to match up to here. Is that correct? I believe so. No, you're, yeah, you're going to want to hook in there. So lay that down flat like you have it, and then that's... Like, yeah, draw That's this yeah. is where it's you going want to, to draw connect it. here. Yes. All right. So I need to bring this. Yes. I would like the bottom to be fairly, you know. Kind of like opacities of paint. You know, they have the little different marker things. Like if they could do that, like with tape on. All right. So stickiness. I need to cut this out. Here because this is all this is gone okay so this needs to be cut out here yes. now this is the purple book although y'all might want to let her know in the chat because I think she's a little further back behind what is it uh, we have somebody new in the chat but sometimes like when you first come in it'll put you a, a bit earlier in the stream so if they come in later they're further back and see, I've indicated that I want more of a uh, organic edge. Or organic edge there. Less straight. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to I'm going this is going to be cut out. Then I think I'll be able to figure that out, but you know, you never know. It doesn't hurt. Doesn't hurt to write yourself a note. Mm-hmm. So this, I need to bring in the chopper and cut that. <clears throat> so at least that's a straight edge. <laughs> There's markers on the stream. <laughs> what is it? I think she's it. She was just at Baby Cheeses ago. So it's just a little while back. <laughs> oh, that's funny. She's, she's at the Baby Cheeses. Baby Cheeses. Well, you know, if we ever, you know, end up in different adventures or whatever, wouldn't it be fun to have cheese that's called Baby Cheeses? <laughs> And spell it. You know, kind of like the little 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 cheese rounds. You know, little baby cheeses. Randy says it's not matching again. <laughs> it will. Don't worry. What is it? Randy's worried that you cutting not off the wrong good. part. Yeah, maybe. Don't worry, we're going to double check. Oh, Julie, she just drew it out. She rolled out a big piece of paper. That's where the that roll paper really comes in quite handy at times. Okay, see? This is going to work here. As soon as I bring my this here. And what I may do here, even though it's not a really good connection, you think you could make that happen, Mariah? If I Yeah. 
have yeah, that. Yeah, just give me something to work. Yeah. That, it, yeah. Yeah. Enough there. Because I think it's important that you don't have a lot of this top part. Because remember, that's where the texture paste is going to be flopping around. Because it's going to be heavier than, well, mm -hmm. probably won't be by the time I get a bunch of stuff glued on there. But, you know, who the hell knows? <laughs> Uh, it, we can it, only plan so much, y'all. I can only plan so much. <laughs> then it's like, you know, reading the future. <laughs> oh, it's, uh, K, K. Brooks, uh, this one over here is extremely directionally challenged. So that's why this is also a very impressive feat. Spatially. I, I, yeah. I, you know, we laugh about, you know, me being spatially retarded. But, um, That's right. Be prepared to modify your plan. That's right. Mm -hmm. All right. Now, am I going the right way here? I believe so. According to your last little thing that you did there. Yeah. Yeah. And then this one's going to flip over like Correct. this. Okay. All right. And, and then this is, is this the back? No, we're, the back is, I think, the next piece. I don't know. Maybe I've How many one. more pieces? I think I've got one more page to do. Okay. I don't know. This is I, I don't know that this is terribly informative. I think it is. Um, and it's kinda helpful. If for I me to if be I here. were watching this, I would have already started watching something else. Thinking, Oh dear God, give me a break. This is painful. I hope y'all don't feel that way. Alright, now see here we got we've got this up here. Mm -hmm. Now I'm going to put down my um, your template thing. Cut that side, All right? Look, we're still accordioning. I, that, I'm excited about that. Yeah. Considering you know my last experience. Well, and, and then those of you that have been around for a couple books, you probably have a, an even wider, like, hopeful, like, appreciation to the things that went on behind <laughs> the scenes about decisions and such. Pulling in more of the chipboard stuff, even though I don't necessarily. I, like I will it. tell y'all though. Like, here's the thing with this one funny. over here. Oh, and actually, we need to do a little giveaway, don't we? Oh, we do. Um, what time is it? We got 15 or 13 Shoot, minutes. I, I, was, I was really hoping I could get to the. Okay, damn it. What was I saying? What did though? I do with my? I don't know what I was saying. Oh, here it is. All right, so what page did we just do? <laughs> Mo says she loves it. I love how Pete puts all her plans in, a, in place. <laughs> and then I don't follow the instructions. Is that right? Thinking that? No. I, 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 all right, so what part, page did I do here? Well, like I said, if you would have numbered those, it would have made this a little bit. Okay, this easier. is the page that we just finished up. Okay. okay? Mm -hmm. That's it. So, the next page is going to There she goes. There you go. Down. Okay, so that's pretty straight when you did. Yeah, it really is and okay. it's straight on this side. Okay. And then this side has some kind of weird stuff. And that's probably good because you kind of need some Every now and then. stability. Yes. In the middle there. And this is the next to the last hello page. Tracy. Well, I said hello in the very beginning, but hello to Tracy's granddaughter. Okay, and this is the one. Oh, give away. Yeah. <laughs> so I have four of them. Let me get Nightbot going. And we'll do this while Pete's trying to work that out and hopefully not distract her too much so she can. Okay, so I have this very organic, very inorganic, very, you know, whatever. This is going to be out of the middle of the page. So it needs to be a little weirder. A little weirder. Than it was. Okay, and this side needs to be
chopped there. Okay, let's make this go out a little bit more than it'll it won't knock off that piece there. All right, guys, so I am going to go ahead and do three little purpley pinky sheepy. Ooh. Purpley blue pink sheep. So, just close your eyes, smile. I know. Hashtag ATC1. And where am I? Oh, I have a kitty. Put that in the chat. Then remember, um, once I do the drawing, I will put in, Mo will put in, because she's been really good about that here lately, um, hashtag email, and then you will need to email me and say, hey, I was the winner of this card, and here is my address. Unless you were absolutely positive that I have your address, but I still want an email. Because I forget. <laughs> All right, and I am going to hit the roll it in. Let's see, five, four, three, two, one. Nancy J. All righty. Oh, Nancy J. Congrats, Nancy. I she got the pink sheet. She did, and I think she won some. Like she got a Christmas card. She's got some. She's got some good juju. Go buy some a lottery ticket. Some of y'all got some good juju, that's for sure. All right, hold on here. I gotta get everything reset. I don't know why I can't just get this out at one fell swoop. And I don't know either. Because probably I need a new blade. Oh. God knows how long this one's. And there are new blades around here somewhere. Yeah, I've got a drawer. I've got them in the drawer over here. Okay, we're gonna do the other sheet, the little pink pink sheet. Super cute. AT, hashtag ATC2. Well, that, that's kind of chewed out there. <laughs> <laughs> we'll work it out. We'll work it out. All right. Still going. People are still putting it in. I like to leave y'all a little bit of time because I know sometimes it's hard. All right, now I'm going to roll it. Oh, a few more coming in. Isabel Oliviera. All right, Isabel. Remember to email me. Card number two. This is exciting. I like giving away these cards. And I tell you, some of these darn cards are pretty up there. Okay, we're going to do circle, you know, the wavy circle one next. I have to say, this is, I'm very impressed with this one because it's really cool because she did the front side and then the back side has the, like, ghost print of it, I think is what you would call it. The leftover print. I don't know. That's technically the ghost print. Okay, we're just going to make this up a little bit here. Well, y'all have to wait until I get it in there. <laughs> they're, they're working ahead of me. <laughs> All right, they're coming in. They're coming in. That's awesome. Give this a little nip on this straight edge here. And I suspect that we will be doing a little bit of shaping up as we kind of, yes, you know, get once the pages start getting put down or the papers. Okay, I think that looks like I got 22 in there now. 22. Okay, I'm gonna do 23. Okay, I'm gonna roll. Elizabeth O'Connor. Congrats. Okay. 
And final, the stars and moon. The moons and stars. Now this last one, I want to make sure. Ooh, this one got really sparked. Very sparkly. Oh okay. shoot, you see Hold that on. was the one that needed to come all the way all over there. It. Ladies and gentlemen, this is, this is what happens. This so is what, what did happens. you do? We're over here doing giveaways. We're not really paying attention to you. <clears throat> no, you should be. <laughs> now, do I have that on there right? Yes. Okay, yes, ATC4. Go ahead and put that in, y'all. And see, that's good on that back side, but this doesn't need to be... This needs to come down over here and go here before we hook up the next... And we'll just make that kind of come over there. That's all right. You know, it's like Mara said. There may be a few little, more little nips and tucks. Yeah. All right. I am going to roll it. And hopefully we can make Happy that. Happy MH. All right. So this is ATC. So if four. that. Okay. That's. And my back page. Remember my back page is. I, I, a little. I, I don't have a whole back page. A little flappy thing. Yeah. <laughs> so we're just going to go ahead and put that other booger down here. <laughs> just draw it out. All right. You got four minutes. I've got four minutes. Mm -hmm. Man, I was going to get to some good stuff today. This has just been part all of the this stuff. Boring. Well, I guess Thursday will be, you know, more good stuff. <laughs> yeah, maybe so. I mean, I think you should at least finish this up if you can. Okay, now we've got an issue here because remember we've got this little, this thing is going out here. It needs to go, it, it's, it, it's like belly buttons, okay? This needs to go NZ rather than outsy because the um, outsy there is going to be a binder. Mm. Did you see what I'm saying? I will in a minute. My back, see my back page here? Yeah. That looks really cool and everything. But the problem is, is that's not going to allow it to close. Oh, okay. Take your word for it. Mm -hmm. I, I clean every now and again. <laughs> that's good, Ann. Ann has not been bored at all. Sometimes you would scale your projects down. What do you mean? Like you're all, like they're always big. Her books are always big. <laughs> she she makes big books. Well, it, it, it isn't. <laughs> I any... make little books. I'm, I I I want them to fit on the desk. When I roll them all out, you know, all the panels they need to fit on my desk and hopefully within the frame of the camera. Oh, pooty dooty. Where, you know, this one's like, oh, maybe one or two, maybe one and a half panels is going to fit <laughs> in the camera at a time. All right, we're going to have to nip that off there so that that can yeah. tape together with that. Mm -hmm. And we're going to go over here and have a nip out there. <laughs> Apple <laughs> says, don't scale down, P. <laughs> Go big or go home, Susan uh, that's says. That's exactly, you know, I just, I De don't. Devin, she's always so sweet. She says, I like all sizes of journals. <laughs> so she's very diplomatic. She is. <laughs> oh, that reminds me. Uh, those of you that are around tomorrow, Devin will be streaming, um, I think, at 1.30 Central Time. That's usually when I, I think it, when, when she comes up. All right, now we're kind of just making this page up because I don't have a I don't have a a mock-up page. Mm -hmm. Okay, no, this is the one that I want to be hooking up to this one. So. Yeah, that's right. Debbie says the the bigger the book, the more you can fit in. That's right. All right, that's that looks <laughs> great. So this is going to be the last page. So we're going to have this one come up as far as we can get it because this is going to be 
The biggest one of them all. The biggest one of them all. And then what we're going to do, we're not going to cut this it? edge off until we decide what we're going to do over here. What was the song? The biggest one of them all. The big because this oh, is, see there's the back page. That's, that's what you're going to see exposed there. Yes. But I don't know that we need quite that much exposure. <laughs> It's too much exposure. It's got to have the right amount. And then this is going to match up here. Oh, mm -hmm. Yes. I used to be able to sing that song when I was a kid, I think, right? The Big what? Balls song? ACDC, yes. It was kind of embarrassing. <laughs> Okay, do we want to just leave that because then that will show from the back there. Yeah, okay. I, I'm just kind of thinking through this business here. Okay, where's our edge? I don't know who Stefan yeah who are you talking about Joanne Devin yeah Yolan tomorrow she'll yeah because she's doing her she's gonna show her bridge stencil she has her stuff now Get a little knobby thing going there. I'm gonna let her finish this. We're gonna go a little long today. That is the final panel, right? This is, oh, and I was supposed to use that. Uh, it doesn't matter. I've already done it. Done it. Done it. This is the last bit. Thank goodness. <laughs> That's a good call. Okay, I'm just going to have to eyeball that up there. I think that's pretty good. It looks good from here. It does. Well, I'm looking at it. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm not being... <laughs> You're not being snide? No. Okay. I was like, who's Stephanie? I was trying to figure that out. I was like, did we talk about Stephanie? Is there a Stephanie that I should know about? <laughs> okay. Hey, I think this is going to be really cool. I'm very proud of you. I'm I'm proud of me because you all saw the struggle here. The struggle it's is real. real. The struggle is real. Carla said that uh, her daughter sang like a virgin for all the ladies at the beauty parlor when she was small. <laughs> oh, that's one of my most favorite, the Moulin Rouge movie. I just I love that. I, we. How, how does like a virgin move? They, they sing it in the. Do it's, they? In, it's in the Moulin Rouge. Yeah. I didn't really watch that movie much. It is. Okay, did I get that too tight and it's not going to bend back the way it needs to bend? Probably. This was a true tweak it Tuesday. I mean, you can't get any more tweaking than. You can't get any more tweaky than that. Look at that. I'm very excited about this. It's like a real thing now. I mean, it's and then when you open up, see, this is what you're going to see. You're going to see parts of that, yes. parts of this, parts of this. And I think I might even work on those little straight edges when I help you do this that and, will and, and kind I, of round them out. Yeah, and something needs to them. Happen it needs a with little more that. Than, yes. All right, but, guys, thank you so much for hanging out with us once again here on this tweaky, very tweaky Tuesday, as it has been stated. We will be back here on Thursday for Thursday. Thoughts. We'll try to keep them short because it looks like we got lots to do. And I'm very excited about this project. So back to the purple book on Thursday. Probably gluing down some pages. Oh, I'm hoping to because I'm well, I'm you hoping may... to get done here before I see you next is to have um, texture put texture paste on pages that need texture paste. Yeah. And um, gesso. Yeah. Okay, perfect. So I'm, I'm hoping. 
Because I don't know. That may not happen. We'll see. We'll you have see. all day tomorrow, really. Yeah, I do. You can get the gesso and that sort of thing done. I think you need to number those, though. All right, guys. Thank you so much for hanging out. We'll see you on Thursday. Bye. Bye. I do need to.